this is your complete guide to post chain mainnet. What's going on guys? Welcome back to Ocoin Chief where we talk about crypto and blockchain. If you don't want to miss any crypto gems for this bull run, make sure you click the subscribe button now. So post chain mainnet has launched. Officially a few hours ago, Richard Hart made an announcement that both post chain and pulse X, pulse X is the native DEX on pulse chain have launched. So in today's video, I'm going to show you a few things on how to navigate this new blockchain. So to start off, you can connect pulse chain to your MetaMask very easily. If you go to postchain.com, you'll be able to click a button that will connect you to MetaMask, but also you can do it manually. You can go to your MetaMask ribbon, go to add network and input all of the information that you can see on postchain.com, like network name, RPC, chain ID, currency symbol and block explorer. Once you do that, you can go to postx.com. Postx is the native DEX on Postchain and you can go and play around on this DEX right away. So this DEX is very similar to Uniswap because it is a fork of Uniswap. So you can swap between tokens very easily. What you can also do is go to farms and you can earn interest by providing liquidity. As you can see, farms that are available right now is Pulse Chain and Pulse X LP. If you wanna be a part of that, you can go to trade and liquidity and add liquidity. This will allow you to add liquidity between the two pairs, but you can also add different kinds of pairs to this DEX. Once you do that, you can go to farms and stake your LP tokens to earn rewards in ink tokens. You can also go to the three dots and go to the burn section. This will allow you to see live how many tokens of Pulse X are being burned. So in traditional Uniswap, some of the fees go to the Uniswap company and they earn money by you trading. Whereas on Pulse X, this number goes to the burn address. So there isn't a company that takes that money. It is basically buying up post chain. It is basically buying up post X tokens, meaning that they are def deflationary since day one. As you can see, it's already been seven hours since post chain launched. And we can see that we are just over 1.8 billion PLS X tokens burned. This number will increase significantly. So this is how you navigate on pulse X. Another big announcement that's going to come out within the next 48 hours is that the bridge between Ethereum and Pulse Chain is going to be opened. Once that bridge drops, I'm going to be creating a tutorial on how you can earn interest by providing liquidity. But if you want to keep your tabs open on Rich Hearts Twitter, I do recommend you guys do that because the announcement about the bridge is going to come to this place straight away. And once the bridge drops, you'll be able to move value from blockchain to blockchain. Another interesting website that you can go to, I'll link this in the description below, is the website that allows you to scan for your post chain tokens. It allows you to click scan and it will automatically add your tokens that you have on Ethereum site to your post chain MetaMask. So this is an interesting site to go to if you don't want to manually go through all your tokens. But you can also go to prc20s.com and input your Ethereum address in here. And this will show you exactly how much your free ERC20 copies on Pulse Chain are worth in USD value. But a true USD value will be known once the bridge that we spoke about earlier drops. So again, make sure you look at Richard Hart's Twitter if you are waiting for that bridge. I am definitely waiting to see what that bridge allows us to do because I have a lot of strategies that can be used to earn money from that bridge. So these were a few interesting sites to keep your tabs open on. And this is how to navigate Postchain and Postex. Another tutorial is coming on the bridge. So make sure you click the subscribe button now and I will see you in the next one.